Welcome, Dr. Schauer. Thanks, Michelle. Can everybody hear me clearly? There's no echo. Okay, great. Um, I think now I just need to figure out if I'm allowed to share my slides. Um, so I'll, I'll give it a minute. Um, maybe since we're short on time while they're waiting to figure out how I can be allowed to share my slides, I just wanted to provide a little bit of additional um, background information about the Cannabis Regulators Association. We've been around for about a year and a half. We convene cannabis regulators from 43 different states and territories. Michelle Nakata is actually on the board of the organization. We're a nonpartisan, nonprofit organization. We don't take an official position for or against legalization. Rather, we seek to provide learning across regulators that are implementing cannabis uh, legalization programs for medical or adult use. Um, and we work through committees and um, a board that are staffed by folks from regulatory agencies. Um, so happy to be a resource to this committee. I have a short time with you today to talk about policy. Um, and so I'm happy to uh, share resources that CANRA has or um, provide further information on topics that we won't get to today. So now it does look like I'm able to share my screen. So hopefully everybody can see this in the room and online. Uh, great. So here's the map of CANRA so you can see who our members are and Hawaii is a member of the Cannabis Regulators Association. Um, and hopefully you're excited about CANRA. I have to acknowledge up front that I have nothing to disclose in what I'm going to share with you today. While it does represent um, my experience working with states over the past decade on cannabis policy and it represents policy tracking that we do, it's not an official position of CANRA or any of the agencies or states that I work with. 